We are here, folks, in downtown Nashua, New Hampshire, on a cold Saturday, March 10th of 2012, just about to start our outreach to expose the ICLEI, the International Council on Local Environmental Initiative. And what we see here is a little storefront called Renaissance Downtowns at Nashua, dedicated to authenticity and quality of life. Or should I should say dedication to authenticity and quality of life. Back in uh, early October of 2011, we did a presentation in town on the subject of Agenda 21, and it was somewhat well attended. But two weeks beforehand, I'm in town doing a little advance work, and I found this little storefront. So it was intrigued by it. I walked in, and I'm going to be showing you in a few minutes here. I walked in and I saw some blown up maps of Nashua. And then I went and looked to my right, and there was a big sign that said, What is smart growth? I said, Ha! Ah, looks like Renaissance Downtowns is somewhat involved in implementing Agenda 21. So I got some information from a nice lady that works, young lady that works here. And it looks like they're doing everything to promote Agenda 21. There's a building project, uh, what we call a stack em and pack em, that they're supporting. And uh, when we gave our presentation that October uh, evening, at the National Library, and I made reference to this group. One of the ladies in attendance said, oh yes, these folks are having meetings all the time, and they testify at, he stay, uh, at the uh, City Hall, the hearings, that we have too many single-family homes already in Nashua, no more single-family homes. So Renaissance is the entity that uh, works with community, people in the community, stakeholders I, is the term they use, to promote uh, the build the stack them and pack them to implement the uh, Agenda 21. You won't see any term, you will not go in here and see the term Agenda 21 anywhere, but you will see, you won't see any UN logos, but you'll see smart growth and sustainable development everywhere. And when I asked the nice young lady well, who funds Renaissance Downtown, she said, well, federal and state money. Uh, there's, some, there's also some private money. They call these partnerships. Uh, Mussolini called it fascism, but uh, it's sort of a green fascism. So anyway, if you're fighting Agenda 21 and you happen to spot this Renaissance Downtowns in your town, uh, then you'll know uh, a lot of folks here are aware of Agenda 21 to some extent. They're not aware of ICLEI and they don't know a whole lot about Renaissance. And by the way, there's another layer of uh, law called um, benefit corporations in many states. Oh, about seven or eight already have passed legislation uh, creating these benefit corporations. Sorry for the background noise, we're in downtown Nashua. Um, the benefit corporations are uh, a new layer where the businesses that are certified green get special privileges. Again, uh, Mussolini at least was honest, he called it fascism. So it's sort of a green fascism. And lots of businesses simply buy into it just so they make payroll. I don't think they're necessarily all uh, high-level greeny globalist, but they want to make payroll and they want to get customers and they think it's the way to go. And my suggestion is that you use your resources to save the free market system and fight Agenda 21. So, uh, what we'd like to, uh, if you're interested in learning more about this, jbs.org, uh, Choose Freedom, Stop Agenda 21 on Facebook, many other fine Facebook groups, uh, groups like Democrats Against Agenda 21, in Massachusetts, you've got MassachusettsLPA.org. Uh, give me a call at 857-498-1309 if you're interested in uh, perhaps putting on a presentation in your town. And uh, we hope to have a nice day here, exposing Agenda 21.